This is not a dump, but a pothole in the middle of a highway. <laughs> When traveling, it's customary for people to wish each other a safe journey. The phrase safe journey would be achievable if the driver is in excellent health, the vehicle is capable of moving on safe roads, and God is by the side of the driver. However, the phrase safe journey would not be viable if our major roads are covered in deadly potholes. This stretch of the road is linking Wa and Drapa. And whilst we were recording, some road users poured their frustrations on the nature of the road to Upper West PR TV. I think the last time I remember, I did a pregnant woman a favor. In the middle of the night, I wanted to carry the pregnant woman from a village to uh, Nadoli the street hospital and you can imagine the state of the road i was just bumping into portals and manholes just like that so i think this 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 road network they have to do something about it it's so bad it's really really wretched Drivers who ply the Wadrapa Road and the Wakumasi Road have expressed how the potholes are affecting their vehicles and their businesses. Mm -hmm. so <laughs> According to the National Road Safety Authority here in the Upper West Region, about 44 crashes were recorded in the year 2022 and 49 recorded in the year 2023, representing 11.4 percent. The Assistant Planning Manager Michael Opong has been speaking to Upper West PR TV. If you look at the number of crashes we had in 2022, it was 44. But then for injuries, we had 85, and then for deaths, we had 22. 
And so if you compare it with what we had this year, for the crashes, there was an, uh, a marginal increase of 11.4%. And so for this year, from January to May, we've recorded 49 crashes. But then for the number of injuries, there was a significant reduction of 24.7%. And so in terms of injuries, the numbers went down from 85 last year to 64 this year. That is from January to May. And also in terms of the deaths, we also have had significant reduction and so for last year we had 22 but for this year we've recorded 18 18 though we've had an, a decrease but 18 is also a huge number and so a lot of uh, activities have to be geared towards reducing some of these numbers. Potholes do not only cause road accidents but creates an avenue for armed robbery attacks. This area right here is between Sombo and Serukere and a few years back an armed robbery attack occurred here and unfortunately one person lost his life. Road users have made a passionate appeal to the Ministry of Roads and Highways and the government in general to come to their aid by fixing the potholes. This is not a dump, but a pothole in the middle of a highway. My name is Hati Nwade, reporting for Upper West PR TV, Nadoli Kaliu.